Hi, I'm Ash and this is Lockie. For the past three and a half years, we've lived out of our tiny home to explore Europe. We packed up our lives in Australia to experience new places and do new things. After three years, one pandemic and thousands of kilometres later, we cross into Croatia. Join us and subscribe to our channel as we explore Croatia together. What's going on here? Nothing, we're just waiting for the train. You're the one making a big fuss out of it. We've been sitting here for half an hour. The train is like a cargo train and we don't know what's happening. It hasn't moved. Another train came and went. We're just sitting and there's a local man with his trailer in front. He's been here longer than us. Probably like 40 minutes probably. So we don't know if they're loading and unloading it, but it's really annoying because it's taking a lot of time it's from today's trip. Deal. We have two hours to get to Pula today. We are like halfway between there and Zagreb where we were yesterday. We stayed at a little campsite down by the river in a small town just off the freeway. And now this morning we are stuck trying to get out of there back to the freeway. Yep. And the toilet's full. And the toilet is very full. We need to empty it when we get to Pula. This morning we have arrived in Pula. It is a really quiet Friday morning, it's early, it's only just about 9.30 now so it's very quiet in town and I think a lot of places are also closed for the season because uh, it is a bit of a touristy place so I guess they're having some time off after a busy summer. definitely see the Roman influence in this town with all the ancient remains and buildings and things. We're just walking towards the Pula Arena or Amphitheatre and it literally looks like the Colosseum. Probably in better shape to be honest. <laughs> so we just bought some truffle cheese from the markets in this region of Croatia. It's called Asteria, I think. Um, and truffles are really big, so we got some truffle cheese. in Ravine and it is about 45 minutes up the coast from Pula um, and it's meant to be a really beautiful coastal place so we're going to spend the afternoon here. New shoes? Yeah. Well how much were they? <laughs> Must be nice. Cheap. They were a very good deal. Wow. They were under 50 euros. Wow. Cheap. Must be nice. It is. My off bomb. They just they got holes in them and I <laughs> still use them.
What do you think of Ravine? It's very beautiful. It is. Having some lunch on the harbour, went mm -hmm. to a bakery. bunker just on the water just in front of the old town start coffee Absolutely beautiful. Definitely high on our list of really nice places we've been to. Like, definitely recommend if you're in Croatia to come. Definitely come and check out Rovina because it is just, like, super beautiful and I really love it. So I was super hipster and I just had a great time. Like it's so relaxing and like, peaceful. Namaste. Anything else you'd like to add? <laughs> Embarrassed now? You should be. Yeah.